Hello, and welcome back to Road Trivia, the once a day road trip trivia quiz. Today's episode is number 808. The category is Friday Night Pub Quiz number 11. This is a 21 question trivia quiz with 20 regular questions up front and a question 21 tiebreaker at the very end of the video if you need a tiebreaker. All of these questions come from different categories, varying degrees of difficulty. So good luck on today's quiz. Question one, the emission type emits its own light, such as the great one in Orion. The dark type obscures starlight behind it as observed with the horsehead one. The planetary type results from a supernova, such as the crab one. What are these collections of gas in space? The Horsehead, the Crab, and the Great Nebulas. Question number two. According to tradition, she agreed to ride through the streets without clothing if her husband would lift taxes on the townspeople. Who is this 11th century woman who shares her name with a chocolate maker? Her name is Lady Godiva. Question number three. An adult has about 25 trillion. They are formed in bone marrow and are destroyed in the spleen. What are these cells, also called erythrocytes, that are disc-shaped cells transporting oxygen in the body? Disc-shaped oxygen transporters are called red blood cells. Question number four. Its soundtrack included songs called Southampton, Rose, An Ocean of Memories, and The Sinking. What is this 1997 film that also included Celine Dion's My Heart Will Go On? That movie was Titanic. Question five. The series include Messiah, Children of, God Emperor of, Heretics of, and Chapter House. What is the name of these books by Frank Herbert and his son Brian about a desert planet that produces a spice? That planet is Dune. Question number six. The domicile of the Koopa villain and the base of operations for his army. In the Super Mario Brothers game for the NES, Bowser is located in the castle in the world with what number? The castle being the fourth section in that world. The castle was located in level four of world eight. Question number seven. What 1970s TV series about three women detectives with a mysterious employer was updated in 2000 and 2003 with hit movies starring Cameron Diaz, Lucy Liu, and Drew Barrymore? That show and the movie was called Charlie's Angels. Question number eight. 1900 to 1903 is called his blue period, while 1904 and 1905 is the rose period, indicating colors that what Spanish artists predominantly used during those times?
the blue period and the rose period were periods of art from Pablo Picasso. Question number nine. To get to the title location, the friends created a bridge. In what Newbery Medal winning book by Katherine Patterson does a boy lose a close friend with which he shared a special place? The title of that book was Bridge to Terabithia. Question number 10. What two-word term did Webster's Dictionary add in 2002 that describes the aggressive behavior by motorists that occurs after an irritating act by another driver? Officially added to the dictionary in 2002, road rage. Question number 11. Though this German chemist developed the spectroscope and a version of the electrochemical battery, what was the last name of the man who is best remembered for a burner to heat and set fire to chemicals that is now named after him? known as a Bunsen burner. His name was Robert Bunsen. Question number 12. Two answers are required. Two of Harry Potter's least favorite people are his potions instructor and the Animagus who hid as scabbers after betraying Harry's parents. What are the names of these two characters? The first is Severus Snape, and the second is Peter Pettigrew. Question 13. The opposite of this type of reaction is called exothermic. The dissolving of salt in a water is an example of what kind of reaction in which heat is absorbed from the surroundings. The opposite of exothermic is endothermic. Question 14. Native Americans called this sport Bagataway, but French Canadians renamed the sport for the symbol of a bishop. What is the name of this sport that uses netted sticks to throw a ball into a pyramid-shaped net? That sport is now known as lacrosse. Question 15. Its name means pipe in German, and the term also refers to a region of eastern Scotland. What is the name of this high-pitched flute which is often associated with military music? The answer is a fife. Question 16. While at Harvard Medical, he wrote commercially to supplement his income. Who is this author of The Andromeda Strain, Sphere, and Jurassic Park? The author of those books is Michael Crichton. Question 17. Starring Matthew Broderick, what 1986 film involves Sloane Peterson, Cameron Fry, 
and the title character visiting Wrigley Field and the Sears Tower while playing hooky from school. The answer is Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Question 18. The body of water he crossed between Siberia and Alaska is now named in his honor. What was the name of the Danish navigator that was sent by Peter the Great to explore North America? He is the namesake of the Bering Strait. His name was Vitus Jonasson Bering. Question 19. Meg marries Lori's tutor. Joe marries a German professor. Amy marries Lori. And Beth dies before marrying. In what Louisa May Alcott book do all of these life events occur? That is all from the book, Little Women. Question 20. Often the team with a disadvantage assumes a defensive position. In hockey, what two word term describes the time period when a player on the opposing team has earned a penalty, thus giving your team a man advantage? That is known as a power play. All right, that is it for today. Thank you for watching today's episode of Road Trivia. Theme song, boom. Check back tomorrow. We'll be doing, I think tomorrow is Tim Burton trivia. For Saturday Night at the Movies, we will be doing Tim Burton. He's the one who did The Nightmare Before Christmas. I won't give you any more hints because I don't want to give away any of the questions. But tune in tomorrow for Tim Burton trivia for Saturday Night at the Movies. Not sure what Sunday and Monday are, are going to be, but then next week will be the same as normal. Brainy Tuesday, all the regulars. Thank you for watching. I know today is the big one. Everybody likes Friday night pub quiz, so I'm thinking about adding another random trivia quiz throughout the week. We'll see um, if I can come up with enough random questions for that. But we're on episode 808 today. Tomorrow's 809, which means less than, well, less than 200 more to go to hit the 1,000 episode mark. Thank you, everybody who's been here. Thank you people who are just now finding this. I appreciate it. Here is question 21 for today, the tiebreaker. What 1987 movie stars Carrie Elwes as Wesley, the farm boy turned pirate who saves Buttercup from marrying Prince Humperdinck? The answer is The Princess Bride. Alright, that is the end. See you tomorrow for Saturday Night at the Movie Trivia.